Guys, we have arrived in Sparta. We are here. What storm? Yeah, like I guess it's getting a bit rainy and a bit, a bit choppy. But yeah, we are actually here in Sparta. We have arrived. I'm hoping Mommy's gonna be there to greet us. Because this might get a little bit heated. Will Alexios be accepted? Will he be accepted as a Spartan? Because the last time he was here, he was getting kicked off a cliff. So, uh, yeah. This could get a little bit awkward. Nearby. There is. And I gathered it. A bit of, a bit of wood. Right, we've arrived. Ready the ship for mooring. So this is Sparta. Finally done it. We've arrived. Full circle. And I'm hoping that is our mum. Standing right over there. Ready to greet us. We'll do quickly to accept some of these, uh, these quests. 32, 30, 32, 34. Ouch. I am level 30 now. I've gone up a little bit. Hopefully high enough. I'm here! Lamb, you made it. Of I course. trust the seas were favorable? Poseidon might be the only one not trying to kill me. And did you go to Thera? Did you find him? I did. What did he tell you? He <sighs> told me a lot. He told me where I'm from. And where I must go. So now you know the truth. I'm not his son. I'm just a weapon. That is the furthest thing from the truth. You were brought into this world with love. I never imagined we'd stand on Spartan soil together again. But we are. We are here. I have mixed emotions. I bet he does. <laughs> Conflict. Anger. Pleased to be home. Confused. One confused man. As much as I curse this place for what it did to us, it feels more like home than Cephalonia ever did. Sparta is our home. But we'll have to rid ourselves of the puppet king if we are ever to find peace. Whatever happened to our old house? Nicolaus stayed after I left, but now that he's gone, I don't know. Why don't we go find out? Of course. But first, there's something I want to show you. Let's do it. Uh, I have increased the level of the Wolf Spartan Helmet. So I'm wearing it right now. This is Nicholas's helmet on my head. I thought it would be quite fitting to do this. Let's take this horse. Come on. Oh, there we go. So where are we going? Where are you taking me? Talk to the woman. Maybe one day I'll come back. Uh, that's from the uh, the message board back there. I'll come back one day. Potentially. I wonder if we can get Sparta with the Athenians. Is that a possibility? That is a wolf. Just gonna skip past. It's all good. Okay, let's go a bit quicker, please. This wolf is chasing me down. There we go. Slice. Level 32 wolf. What's she getting off? Off we go. Okay. Oh, just chop my mum in half. Stupid wolf. Ow, what's just got my pulse over. Enough of that. Just gave it a kick. I think there is an ability where you can actually recruit the wolves. But I don't have that right now, so. We move on. Where's my horse gone? <laughs> it's disappeared. There it is. Ella. Ella. The closer we get to Sparta, the more memories keep flooding in. No matter how far I ran, I never could escape them. I know. On that I will forget. It was as if I had locked Sparta in a box and yeah. pushed her to the bottom of the sea. I put memories of us in that box. I want to. Oh, come on. Uh, fine. 
Don't really have much stress. Gotta fight this wolf. He's missing me. Level 32 as well, so I'm a little bit underpowered. Okay, don't, don't attack the Spartan. I'm not blending. Stupid Spartan. Don't attack him. There we go. I'm friendly. I apologize. I did not mean to swing at you. This has been an interesting little journey. <laughs> Freaking wolves. Keep attacking me. Come on. So soon we arrive in Sparta. That wasn't exactly Sparta, that was like the dock. Uh, we're going inland a little bit. And then we arrive in Sparta. I'm hoping we go and visit our old home. That would be quite fitting to see the cliff as well again. That'd be terrifying, wouldn't it? The flashback we'd get. Ooh. Have we arrived? Is this the cliff? No, that's not a cliff. <laughs> There's no water below. This is where I first trained you to use your spear. Hesitation only hastens the grave. <laughs> you remembered. How do you think I got this far? We had to pry that spear from your hand while you slept. You said you needed it to fight the monsters in your dreams. I couldn't face Cerberus empty-handed. Those children will be ripped to shreds. We should help them. Alexios, wait. You shouldn't interfere. This is Spartan training territory. So we just... We just sit back? Okay, fine. I hope you're right. For their sake. The Agogi is what turns boys into men. Interfering would only weaken them. Weaken Sparta. They're no good to Sparta if we leave them to die. And they're no good to Sparta if they're too weak to kill a wolf. Come. Let's go home. If you watch that 300 film, you see something similar to when it actually happens. It's almost like a trial. Incredibly scary trial. A young sort of teenager boy will fight a wolf, will fight a creature, and they have to kill it. It's, uh, yeah. For such a young age to do that. That training is ruthless. Not ruthless. Ella. Effective. The best of those boys... Stalkers in the night. There's a reason Sparta never changes. It has rules and they are strict. Spartans rule Laconia, but most of its citizens are Ilotas, enslaved peasants made to work the fields and mines. Slaves? Why don't they revolt? Spartan Sparta! Keep them fed, and Spartan warriors keep them safe. First from the Persians and now from the Athenians. Okay, hey, now we're peace, here. The Cryptia are ordered to keep the peace. I see. Most of us make great sacrifices for comfort. I never thought I'd find myself back in Sparta. It looks so Sparta. Despite the war raging elsewhere. Most. Not all. Yeah, it looks pretty... It does look really red, doesn't it? It feels like... Sparta. Red everywhere. It's cool to finally be here. It's been a long journey. We have arrived. So we're going back home. We caused absolute chaos in the crowds. I'm coming. Just a little bit lost. Just pushing past everybody. <laughs> Oops. Loot. Ooh. Level 33 bow. Is this it? This was the first and last place I ever felt safe. As soon as you were old enough to hold a spear, you trained in this yard from morning till night. Nikolaus was a tough teacher to please. He hid his pride from you. But every night he would tell me He's going to bring glory to Sparta. Wow. 
As much as I hate him for what he did, I wouldn't be who I am today without his training. My heart broke that day. But for the first time in ages, standing here with you, I truly believe it can mend again. Me too. Do you remember the first time you held your sister? <laughs> I was scared I'd break her. I piled every blanket and pillow we had around me. Even then, you held her so tight, I thought you would squeeze the life out of her. She turned out stronger than we thought. The gods must be playing tricks on my eyes. Good to see you. Good to see you, Vrasidas. It's been a long time since I rescued you from the warehouse fire in Corinth. <laughs> That's not how I remember it. You look well, Vrasidas. The rumors were true. You're alive. Many we thought to be dead are still breathing. When I heard the two of you came home... We're in Sparta, but we're not home yet. We want our house back, Vrasidas. Sparta claimed your estate after Nikolaos' disappearance. They're waiting for his adopted son to claim it. But he hasn't returned from the war. Stentor? Oh, I knew I should have killed him on the beach. Hmm... How do we get it back? I wonder if we killed... Nikolai with a... This would be completely different. Surely it would. Sparta can't just take our home. They can. They did. And if you want it back, you'll have to convince the kings, which won't be easy. Why not? As happy as I am to see you, the kings won't be. Especially Achidamus. Your exit from Sparta wasn't exactly... graceful. He can't still be mad I broke his nose. You what? In any case, he hasn't forgotten. But I have an idea that might help him forgive. Tell us. Spartan soldiers have been giving weapons to the Ilotes. Whoever takes care of these traitors will earn his thanks. Okay, tell me more. Why on earth would Spartan soldiers be helping Ilotes? Ilotes greatly outnumber Spartan citizens. But they're leaderless. Mostly farmhands, servants, and apprentices. If someone unified them, armed them, and trained them, they'd be a real threat to Sparta. But you said it was Spartans who were arming them. All the more reason to deal with this quickly. You find out why the Ilotes are being armed, and you'll have the king's attention. Where will I find these Spartans? They were last spotted in the Gorani marble quarry, in the forest of Eurotas. So, I find the soldiers, then what? Spartans are loyal to their commander. Take him out, and the rest should disperse. And the weapons? Destroy them. The Elotes have caused enough trouble with shovels and sickles. <laughs> the last thing Sparta needs right now is them carrying swords. I'll take care of this. So, to get our house back, I must take out the Spartan commander responsible for inciting a useless rebellion. Sounds easy enough. Find me in the throne room when it's done. And where will you be? This is where I raised you. It's also where Leonidas raised me. I'm going to visit his tomb just beyond the estate. You should pay your respects too before you get started. I'll try. Home sweet home. So we've got a hammer we can't even use. It's not exactly high enough yet. Should we do that one first? As it's fairly close? So this is where Leonidas is. And there's something about bullies. I don't quite know what. I'm hoping we're going to be good enough. We, we are level 30 still. I'm close to leveling up, but yeah, that, that is a slight concern. So where is the Leonid Leonidas tomb? Is it close? Whoa. Okay, that is impressive. Grandfather was a true hero. Maybe one day, they'll sculpt the statue of me. Maybe one day. Probably not. <laughs> Leonidas. He was Sparta's last true hero. We'd all be under the yoke of the Persian Empire if it wasn't for his courage. The same blood courses through your veins. I don't believe it. I've never forgotten. Never, never, never. So, our blood 
is the blood of kings. You are so much more than a mercenary. You carry the blood of heroes, blood of power. Remember what I told you? That people would try to take that power for themselves. And then you promised. I wouldn't let them. Hold out your spear. How do they do that? <laughs> All of this talk of the Pythia, the Pythia, I do not care what she says. Enough! We have grown tired of your insolent tongue. Sparta will not go to war. The Pythia has spoken. Pythia says what you tell her to say. She has been your puppet for far too long. The time has come to cut her strings. Oh, Leonidas. The days of heroes are over. You think your blood makes you special? If we opened your veins, it would spill to the ground and disappear through the cracks. You are no one. You are more than welcome to find out. Your fate is sealed, son of the lion. Xerxes will unite us. He will bring order to chaos. Defy the Pythia and everyone you love. Everything you stand for will perish. Gather them then. My king? Xerxes wants Sparta. You'll have to go through me. Well, that explains quite a bit. So that explains why the cult are not massive fans of our family. Incredible. Now, do you understand? What must I do? It's time we embrace our destiny. Both of us. If we don't stop the cult before it's too late, then all Leonidas fought and died for was for nothing. Our bloodline has reason to those who would enslave us. It's time we rise again. Well, well, well. Mother and son united in Sparta at last. And look at you, a god and goddess among mortals. King Pavsanias, we're honored. I was sorry to hear about your father. Yes, our fathers would have been proud to see us here today. You remember Alexios, my king? Who could forget the boy who died to save his sister? Such a tragedy. An innocent child put to death because of an ancient, merciless law. I wasn't the only one put to death. Sparta found me guilty. You don't sound like most Spartans. He doesn't, I guess. That's true. Ancient and merciless. Most Spartans live and die by these laws. But you sound more... progressive. And you sound like you've been rubbing elbows with Athenians. I've been to a symposium or two. In any case, Sparta was weakened by losing you. Losing you both. We're examples of why these laws must change. Oh, I agree. But King Archidamos, if he could carve Spartan law across the chest of every citizen, he would. I long for peace. I've spent my whole life looking over my shoulder. If Sparta is to be my home again, I'd rather it be a peaceful one. <laughs> Peace at what cost? When Spartans aren't killing, they're training to kill. And when they're not killing Athenians, they're declaring war on their own people. But we're not here to talk about the dead, are we? We know Sparta reclaimed our house after what happened to my father in Megaris. We want it back. Mind your tongue, child. You may not live in Sparta anymore, but I'm still your king. We graciously request an audience with you and King Archidamos to discuss reinstating our citizenship and reclaiming our home. Of course. There is nothing I'd want more. Archidamos, however, still hasn't forgiven you for the whole nose incident. What can we do to sway him? There's rumor of a Illot rebellion and the Kreptia are stalking the flames. Savagely killing Hillots, stealing livestock, and leaving corpses to rot in the streets. The Cryptia represents Sparta's ultimate achievement in military training. Their discipline and fearlessness make Sparta's army the most feared in the world. 
once, but the Kreptia have become corrupt and bloodthirsty. And training boys to kill unarmed peasants is nothing to be proud of. Do you want your home back or not? Good. So the Illots will no longer support the senseless slaughtering of their people. And where would I start looking for these Kryptia? One can be found in the fort on Zarax Point. Another was assigned to guard the Spartan leader's house. The third is more elusive. He was last seen in one of the villages west of Ilot Hills. He's definitely the loudest of the three. My mother spoke to me about these Kreptia. What can you tell me about them? They are the hidden ones. Hand-picked at an early age, starved and trained in isolation. They must steal and kill to survive. If they succeed at their training, they become the king's guard. But why have me killed them? For years, the Kreptia kept the peace between the Illots and Spartans. Troublemakers and threats among the Illots were dealt with. But lately, these Kreptia have been killing men, women, and children without reason or mercy. Babies ripped from their mothers and fed to the wolves. The Kreptia have become a breeding ground for ruthless savages. Is there anything I should know about King Archidamos? Traditional, brutal, boring. Archidamos values the old ways over the welfare of his people. He sided with the elders that day on Mount Taietos. If killing Kryptia will get our home back, I'll do it. Alright. So there's three of these members. And we got to take them out. One by one. Oh, this sounds easy. Sarcasm. Let me guess, they're all like level 32. And I'm gonna struggle. Believes in the old ways. On killing his Kryptia creates conflict between him and Posonias. I miss Kefalonia sometimes. Life was simple, even if Marcos was a bumbling idiot. It was a lot more simple, wasn't it? Simple tasks about wood. <laughs> that was pretty much it. It's all political now. The current king sounds a little bit traditional. Uh, not very modern. And a bit set in his ways, I think, is the, uh, the right way to go about it. Right, so he's here, is he? Oh my god. Level 33. Lovely. Just great. So I've got to somehow kill that guy and leave, basically. I think this might fail. <sighs> so what I might do. Careful. Don't want to be caught here. Agree. Right, I swear if I get anywhere near him. Oh, this is gonna go bad. <laughs> very, very bad. Hmm. Probably sneak in here. Maybe. So what I do? No. Uh, ah. He's standing there. There's a back door. If I whistle, that guy's gonna wake up. That's what I'm worried about. Hmm. Hmm. What do I do? I can do this. I'm not sure that's going to kill him, though. The rush assassination. Oh, screw it. Yep, still alive. Barely. Dead. Good. Get rid of him and... Oh, damn. What the hell? What finished him off. Let me see what I was doing, to be honest. All right, we should probably run. Absolutely run. Sorry about that. This staff heads straight for your head. I think we're good. Surprisingly. That actually worked out alright. So here is our next target. He will be assassinated today. I guarantee that. Hopefully. <laughs> Come on! Uh, where is the Ecryptia? Ooh. Not too heavily guarded. Uh, I say that now. Get a little bit closer. I'm sure he is. 
Luckily, it's nice and dark, so we should be well hidden. Our assassin skills are on point. Oh. Okay, he's sort of in front of a crowd. He doesn't sound very pleasant, though, so hopefully they enjoy this. You will die. Finish him off. Don't care if he's level 32. He's been chopped and taken care of. And that's number two done. <laughs> now for the final one. What what do these do? Do I do I burn these? I don't quite know what they are. Guess you can potentially burn them, but I will not. Right now to the last one, the last member, the last traitor. Oh, I've gone that way. Okay, I was meant to go to that one first. I got clearly distracted. Uh, what I might do is sync up up here. I mean, that is definitely a sync point. That is high up. Let's do it. I mean, I guess the sync points are more just for being a fast way to get around. I think that's pretty much it. Uh, obviously, in the previous games, they were used to gain all the intel of the environment near you. I don't think it really does that anymore. I don't think so, anyway. Sink, sink, sink. Wow. Sparta. It feels weird to have rogue Spartans. I bet that was rare. Very rare. But I'm sure they did exist. So I think the next place we're going to is over there, yeah. On that little weird little island. Hopefully... This goes well. It's gone well so far, considering we are underpowered. We are really destroying them with those quick assassinations. They could just they just can't cope. What a cool little island. Look at this. The only way it links is via this little path. And that's it. This one does look slightly more guarded. Also a bunch of seagulls. Oh no, what was that? Just ignore it, Scott. Focus on the task at hand. Yeah, this looks more fortified for sure. So what I'm going to do is climb up and be stealthy. Oh, it's a full... Oh, my God. Okay. This is going to be tricky. I mean, it's one target. It's one rogue. If we can just take out that rogue and run, that's all I care about right now. And obviously, once we do this quest, we should easily level up. Easily. That's what he says anyway. They'll be watching for me. I need to be careful. Oh, yep, they're definitely uh close by. Oh man, there's loads of them. So that's that guy right there. He's level 34. I don't remember the previous ones being an issue. Or that high even. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna do. Can you hassle that guy? There we go. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Bloody eagles. Jumping up. And assassinate. Woo! Quick little couple of attacks, hopefully. There we go. And I'll just run. Just run for the hills. Just go. Don't need to be here anymore. See you later. Got a slight bounty. Let's go. Just leave. There's a zip line there, which I completely ignored. Quick in and out. Assassination. Perfect. I don't know if they're still trying to chase me. But that quest is done. We have proved ourselves. We have helped the king of Sparta. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hope you guys want to see more. Make sure you leave a like on the video. I'm going to try and level up a little bit. Potentially to like level 32. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.